Hello ladies and gentlemen, I welcome you to this episode, here is Armin for Armin C. And in today's quick tip I want to show you how you can use one of the pots, S1 or S2, to well simulate the behavior of a trim in order to well trim one of the channels. I say simulate because it is not really a trim, but um, it works quite fine and it behaves exactly as a trim. So for this, go to the model menu. I have here model 08. This is a blank new model. Go to the model menu and here we go to the special functions. Add a new special function, other, and here we use act. Then here we use the function adjust, global variable g1. Here long press, mixer source, select s1. I will use the pot s1 here. And don't forget to activate this special function by setting here this check mark. That's it. Now if we go to the drive modes in drive mode 0, we have here the global variable g1. And you see if I turn the pot, then this value changes. Now let's use this global variable in the inputs. Um, per default, channel 1, or this input, the physical input, the steering wheel, is mapped to this uh, ST input, and the trim for the steering is T1 here, and we won't change this. We create another input, oops, input 06, and I set the source to the same as uh, the first input, ST, uh, the, yeah, the ST input, the offset I set to G1, G1, and the trim I set to off. That's it here. Now we have the first input, the ST input is controlled by the physical input steering wheel, and the input 06 is also controlled with the physical input steering wheel. But this input is trimmed with the T1 switch and this input is trimmed with G1, the global variable which is controlled by this pot here. Now let's use this input. We go to the channel 5, say the source is input 6 and turn off the trim and that's it. Now let's check this on the channel monitor here. You see if I turn the steering wheel then channel 1 and channel 5 runs running in parallel, do exactly the same. The channels are controlled by the inputs ST and input 06 and both, both these inputs are controlled by the physical input steering wheel. Now if I trim the, the first input, you see only channel 1 is affected by this trim. And now if I trim with S1 with the pot, you see, we have the same behavior as if we would have used the trim switch. And that's it. With this you can well, simulate trimming uh, the trim function, the standard trim function of the T-switch here. Okay, that's it for this quick tip. Hope you enjoyed it, hope you find it somehow helpful. If so, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much. Until the next time, goodbye. Servus.